Oh hello and thank you for choosing to open my video and if you are a follower of mine on Instagram you might be knowing that I had recently bought some Berom nail polishes which are precisely these four nail paints of which I'm going to review only the two of these in this video and those two will be the holographic ones. So please keep on watching if you're interested and please subscribe to my channel. So let's get straight to the point, this is the first color and the classic silver holographic nail polish. The bottle as you can see is a glass bottle cylindrical in shape and the cap is a glossy mirror finished silver plastic cap. You can pretty well see the holographic effect under direct sunlight and I think many of you nail polish lovers have always scraped a holographic nail paint and if you do not want to spend your money in salon then I think this is a very good choice for you. So this one is shade 501 and this bottle has 10 ml of product. So now I'll just begin swatching. So as you can see the nail paint glides on pretty smoothly. The consistency is quite good. The brush width is just perfect. A few strokes and the nail is covered. But the number of coats required is at least 3. As you can see in the first coat the coverage is not that great. But it made me feel that it can be, uh, it can be made to use as a good holographic top coat. So I think I can have multiple uh, use of this nail paint. The second coat also did not make it opaque enough so I am going for the third coat. So it might not look really great on the camera right now but it has actually built up to be quite opaque after the third coat. So after I've done painting all my nails three coats each so it's time to play around with the holographic effect and as you can see as I move my nail I think you can see the play of colors and it's looking extremely beautiful. So for better visibility and better satisfaction I took this shot under direct sunlight. The play of colors is so pronounced and it is so relaxing to watch and the best thing is you can buy this nail paint and give this effect on your nails at home itself. And these nail paints take at least 10 minutes to dry because I have used 3 coats so obviously it will take a longer time to dry. Single coat dries under 2 or 3 minutes. The texture is a bit grainy to touch and removal is not really easy if you have left the nail polish for a long time because it has glitter particles after all and we all know glitter polishes take a longer time to get removed. After removal you will also find some tiny glitter particles sticking to the skin around your nails as is usually the case with any glitter polish. Now I would test this polish as a top coat so I have painted the base silver and on it I am going to apply a single coat of the holographic silver nail paint and see how it works. So 3 coats of the holographic nail paint versus 1 coat of silver nail paint and 1 coat of holographic nail paint is kind of similar so you can use that as an alternative and save some holographic polish. Now I am going to do the same thing but on a black base and I am pretty excited to see how the result comes out. This is looking absolutely gorgeous, incredible and the fact that you can get this effect easily at home is another bonus point so I just simply love this nail polish and I don't regret buying this at all. Now I'm going to try the other color that is the purple holographic nail paint that I had bought and uh, this is uh, quite opaque in a single coat as you can see but obviously not fully opaque so it will need another coat. This one looks so perfect as well and it's such a visual treat. So I went ahead and tested it under sunlight as well and the best result is visible under sunlight only as you can see there are so many colors inside you can properly see all the play of colors. However, the effect is not so great in normal light that is without flashlight or sunlight. So let's say a few words about these nail paints. So these are cruelty free which is a big pro. These are also organic and let's take a look at what they claim. So they say that they 
uh, leave a nice rainbow sheen on the nails which is true can stay for six days which is also true because they really stick on your nails and uh, they have a high shine formula that has been verified already and these are also five free so that is a very good thing and these nail paints do not need any curing under UV or LED light the components in the nail polish have been listed in details and I give a big thumbs up for that but when I went for shopping, I found the link for the Buram website but it wasn't opening and right now I can't even find that link anymore. So the products are uh, entirely available in Amazon and Flipkart only. When I had shopped, more products were available in Amazon than in Flipkart and now the case has just reversed. I don't know uh, why or how this happened. But I had shopped from Amazon. The Instagram page also doesn't have the link anymore and instead it redirects to the Amazon link only. So finally let's talk about the price. So this particular paint number 501 cost me rupees a hoping for 99 and it did burn a hole in my pocket but the holographic nail paints are very rare so I thought I should just invest in this and the other one the violet number 502 cost me rupees 99 only. I have no clue why there is such a disparity of prices of two polishes from the same range but maybe because the silver polish has a higher demand. So are there any alternatives available in the market given that holographic nail paints are so rare? So you can check the Born Pretty store where they have holographic nail paints and uh, these nail paints do not require UV or LED light or anything of that sort and uh, the prices really vary all the time but I do not know anything about whether they are 5 free or not because I did not find information in the website and also keeping in mind the delivery charge, shipping charge, insurance charge, all of these they add up to a high price and uh, you can also find holographic powders in the same website but these two require an UV lamp and also a water based top coat you can also check this Indian brand called Laroi and they have launched for the first time in India the near holographic nail paints but the price is similar to what I have paid for the prompt one that is for 99 but I think these are vegan cruelty free and also more free from chemicals than the prompt ones so thank you so much for watching and hope this video helped you all do not forget to tell me in the comments and also give this video a big thumbs up and share this video and please please subscribe to my channel see you super soon guys with more videos take care all bye